the thing I think is real that I've said over and over again is the exponential. The idea that every few months we get an AI model that is better than the AI model we got before and that we, we get that by investing more compute in AI models, more data, more new types of training models. Initially, this was done by what's called pre-training, which is when you just feed a bunch of data from the internet into the model. Now we have a second stage that's reinforcement learning or test time compute or reasoning or whatever you want to call it. I, I think of it as a second stage that involves reinforcement learning. Now both of those things are scaling up together as we've seen with our models and as we've seen with models from other, from other companies. And I don't see anything blocking that, the further scaling of that. There's some stuff about, you know, how do we broaden the tasks on the RL side of it. We've seen uh, more progress on, say, math and code, where, where the models are, you know, getting pretty close to like a high professional level and less on more subjective tasks. But I think that is very much a temporary obstacle. Um, uh, so when I look at it, I see this exponential and I say, look, people aren't very good at making sense of exponentials, right? Like, you know, if, if something is doubling every six months, then, uh, you know, two years before it happens, it looks like it's only one sixteenth of the way there. And, and, and so we are sitting here in the middle of, of 2025, um, and the models are really starting to explode in, in, in terms of the economy, right? If you look at the capabilities of the model, they're starting to saturate all the benchmarks. If you look at revenue, and you know, Anthropic's revenue every year has grown 10x. Um, suppose that exponential continued for two years. I'm not saying it will, but suppose it continued for two years, you know, you're, you're like well into the hundred billions. I'm not saying that'll happen. I'm saying the situation is that when you're on an exponential, you can really get fooled by it. Two years away from when the exponential goes totally crazy, it, it, it you know, it looks like it's just starting to be a thing. Um, and so that's the fundamental dynamic.